you know, a, a, a hitting conversion situation that was going to present itself when you use the Kung Lao hat hold as an anti-air. Yes. And Dio, uh, one thing about Dio we don't talk about too much, I have to give this thing, so this honestly is bombing on the one that's crazy. But um, Dio's movement with the tower is actually so fast at times, I have seen the opponents actually get the wrong input of a special because they're on the other side. Yes, yes. Yeah. Happens a ton of times here. I mean, it, it, it's just, nobody has the mobility like this character to just take to the sky and be able to just shift around left and right, up, back, up, forward. But right now, we're not seeing a lot of that here. I, I think one of the strongest attributes to Natara is that she can kind of, as long as the opponent doesn't have something that can, like, snatch her out of the sky, she she dictates the pace. Definitely. Goes from the low into the low. Pokes it to poke. And yo, that was a beautiful the, the beat on the end. Bro, yeah, bro, this, this man, that's that hard fair. to block the Look at the point. Carry off is another hat setup, bro. Still coming. Just the back throw this time. Yeah, probably going for a little bit of a throw mix. They didn't want to be too obvious to see in which direction that they were going to, but it looked like Cease didn't even go for the tech either way. Deoxys coming back here, one round apiece in this first game. Who's going to take the lead? Who is going to keep going and trekking on through here? Cease, pretty patient when it comes to, like, the approach. Like, after he blocks something, seeing a lot of backdashing, doesn't want to really, like, press buttons, doesn't really want to get in there right away. Oh. That hard to block move was actually insane. What is this dude doing? But yes, he wants to get away because why? He wants to set up that clock. Oh, nice burst. Yeah, and instead of going for like any kind of like regular pressure, Cease is looking to get out of the corner. Doesn't want to be trapped here, so to speak, where Natara can just freely move wherever she wants. That was a pretty good one. Right now, oh my gosh, another hard to block. Ooh, good block from Cease. Blocks the corner. Oh my god, big punish. But as a rewind time, gonna get another clock. No, doesn't have quite a bar yet, but the over is connected. Out of there. Oh my god, he tried to up block. Other side once again is plus the staggers. Low hat, more plus range, but guess what? The back throw. I have a clock. Beautiful over No punish. No punish, wasn't ready to press buttons at all. Back it off there, super plus on that Kung Lao hat. And Dio, aka Deox, has taken that first game here. Ooh. Hey, both the players definitely have the stuff they need to do. But towards the end, I'm starting to see Cease like, man, I got to get a read on this guy's movement because it's been kind of tough. He tried to meet uh, Dio for an air-to-air, -air, but Dio immediately went down, mm -hmm. downwards with an air dash and got a down to punish instead. Yeah, it was kind of like that fake, like, I'm going to the air, just kidding. You thought I was going to the air, so you went to the air. Instead, I landed in anti-air. Love to see those split-second decisions happening. And, of course, love to see this execution here from Natara as she just wow. dances around in the sky. And doesn't have an hourglass in here. This man sees his both his damage. Both of the four more. Oh, oh grab with throw! You don't want to see that. You don't want to see that as dear as the animation and just no connection at all. Great reactions here by Cease, recognizing she hit the ground, recognizing the low is going to be the more probable thing to come out here. Block. Oh, bro brother, brother, brother. He's changing the timing. He's changing the timing here. So it, it, depending on when that overhead comes, depending on when you let go of that Kung Lao hat, it's either low overhead or overhead low, and that is so difficult to block. A fun blockable, if you will. Definitely a fun blockable as well. 10% for a little bit of blood. You know, actually, I think about it. Tar probably wants to get his gears and blood the most. Like, that's fine age wine. Like, you know, he's been alive like 10,000 years. I thought it was just, I thought he was just made of sand. <laughs> you know, actually, well, there's got to be something. Like, when he gets hit, this will come out of him, right? It's not sand. Right? <laughs> sand juice coming out. Just little, she just gets like, you know, when you go to the beach and you drop something you really want to eat and you said, I think it's fine if I just clean it off. It's never fine. It's just never leave fine, it. Never. It's never fine. <laughs> That's what Atari gets. That's what she oh, gets. Armors, but the hat is still there for coverage. Oh my god, that could have been a huge one for Gur. Ooh! Gur, yes. Gur risk. Gur yeah, risk is. being in the hands of Seas. That's okay. We play it off here. Deox is taking the second game. 2 0 lead. And a little shrug of defeat from Seas. Can oh, he man. still win this? He's just kind of like, what do I do? Is there literally anyone in the building that plays Natara? Anyone in there that can help Cease because he's looking a little lost. That's not a good look at all. When you when you get a shoulder shrug, 
and you look to your teammates and no one's coming up, that's like, oh man. Uh, uh, we got to, oh my God, Zork actually did play Natara, I think for a total of one week, and then he said this character sucks yeah, and moved on. Cheeks. And guess what? <laughs> Deox De is saying, um, you know what? Yeah. You're wrong. <laughs> So this is literally probably the only other person in this building that can play Natara at a high level. Shout out to Zork uh, and shout out to everybody who's just here watching and enjoying this top 16. He's talking to him. He's literally, he's giving him some dirt. Giving him some dirt indeed. I'm, I'm pretty sure he's just talking some heebie-jeebie and deals just like they're like, I don't know about you guys, but like, if your opponent after they take the loss, just shoulder shrugs, you're definitely up. You're just feeling you know, it. You're, you're definitely you're up. Like, you Your know that you have to match them down. Pat, and they don't know what they're doing. Our fate isn't sealed, I mean, Paris. in such a short amount of time, without an actual, like, setup, without actually any kind of gameplay, I can't imagine what Zor could tell Cease to, to turn the tides around. But maybe just a little break is all he needs. Maybe he can, you know? Duck under the throws, keep it nice and simple. As uh, Deoxys loves the side switch there. Deoxys going for a ride. Hey, I guess he's just like, I don't know when I'm gonna get the throw again, whoa, so I whoa, might as well. Whoa. Yeah, I, I saw a little bit of that before from Cease's previous match, but that's okay. Up block, get the punish, no problem. Oh, Zork might have told him some Zoss. He might have told him a little Zoss. Just a little bit. And with the overhead, that was max range too. And the chip out kill with the sand pillar. Okay, Cease. Showing that he's father time. He went to the future and realized what had a set was going to go, and he said, okay, I got it, I got it. There you go, there you go, there you go. More overheads. That's it, that's what you need. Overheads. And just wait for her. And again, it's, it's. I think it's it's very dependent on the life is. The tower doesn't really have like a projectile to, to, to really like force you to, to come to her or force that, that life lead to like slowly dissipate. Goodness, almost 400 damage for that. 386 to bound shoot. That's a big bloody claw coming at you, but people were going to come out of seas. Too high in the gravity was not going to get a conversion off that, but the low had to play and the clock as well. Oh my god, almost crossed the man's up. The low hat coming through. A beautiful once again. So I was gonna catch him in the air. The low hat. Cease can answer back right here, right now. The command grab. Uh -oh. Yes, is that death? Oh, it is. Okay, what happened to the shoulder shrug? What happened to the lost look? I'm seeing a determined player that might have just needed a few wise word player. Whatever you want to call Zork. Big shout out to Zork for that guest appearance there. Because right now we got a set here. Cease showing signs of life. Cease getting on the board. Seeing a lot more from Man Grab come out of Cease. That oh, is no, no, so no, 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 Afterwards, got a clock. It has that bar to work with. He can't rewind time. The no. reaction, Jackson. Boy, blocked in time. Yeah, it takes a little bit of time to get over to the other side. And again, it's the the Kung Lao hat just recovers so fast. Yes, it just recovers so fast. So I think it was kind of like a, a testament that took both those things. Mm. Another bike. Another bike sand. <laughs> The sandy sand sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> double overhead. No double in top here. Oh, Kung Lao hat stops right in his tracks. This is not where you want to be against the Oxus. Oh, never mind. That was a back throw to get out of the corner. Gonna get launched. Love the challenge from Cease. Frozen. Going for a ride. Oh, baby. Gonna take the ride. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. That's enough. That's enough. Okay, that's enough. Thank you. <laughs> 452 is insane. It's not fair. So much damage. Ooh, nice. I'm seeing a lot more armor when Natara gets oh. in that ambiguous spot. Go over to the other side. I forgot she has air mobility. Most people are uh, expecting the character to drop down with Kung Lao even after an attack, but Natara can get out of there. Okay, that combo. Oh, that death? Very close. Oh. Ah. Ah. Over here, that's a whip, and that's going to be a punish. Deal with a slight pop off. I don't want to see too many pop offs to deal. He said yes. And Cease, unfortunately, is going to be the other 